Hey everybody, what's going on? Shabby do here and today I want to jump back on that shabby experience that was among trees. So I did make a mistake when I was um, wrapping up last time. Like I said, I wanted to go out and do a little bit of farming and I I intentionally increased the storage to the attic so I wanted to see what it looked like and see what I was getting into before I uh, did it. But then I accidentally saved afterwards so I couldn't do it together with you guys. But it was nothing special. Uh, it just required like 20 something planks which was pretty easy when you can just cut down trees all night that's what i did i don't think i slept i just cut down trees so you can see the house is a little bigger now we got a second story on there and so we'll go in there and take a look i was just running around looking for food because i was starving and i realized i had no food besides golden mushrooms but i didn't want to use those like these things that seemed like such a waste so i held on to those for a bit now what's that oh it's just a rock so if I go in here, you can see we've got the upstairs, which is pretty nice, actually. We've got um, three new storage boxes here, and I've got oops, and I've got wood and, like, actually, really just a bunch of, like, random stuff in here. Oh, that's the burdock root. Can I even do anything with that, or does that have to be cooked? I can eat that now. Eat it. Oh, that's worth a lot of food. That's good stuff right there. So let's put these all away and I'll keep this. Uh, that has to be cooked. So we can see here what I've got is I've made myself, oops, put that away. Come into here. I made myself a lock pick. Um, I don't know if this is a one use item. I hope it's not because they weren't cheap. I'll show you that too. But yeah, you can see we got three storages here. Four, sorry, four. I forgot about this one. And then we can build the sewing room. I need to make fur planks is fine uh dog bane stems which i think i saw somewhere and then glue so we got some stuff to do before we can make that happen so i figured first i gotta figure out how to get driftwood too so that's on the list if i can figure out driftwood we can make a cooking room so yeah coming to here you can see no pickaxe did i make the pickaxe no my fishing rods right here I thought I made a pickaxe. I did make the map. So you can see this is where we've explored so far. The map's not too big, but um, remember that time we died? Went around this way. Just kidding. So, looking in here, so I've got that. I could make a compass. I'm not too interested in that. Um, I can make a pickaxe. Steel wire, steel pipe, and beeswax. That seems pretty good. Steel pipe, wire, and beeswax. Um, I'll take the beeswax. Is that the beeswax? I think that's the beeswax. A steel pipe. Oh, so I kept all my crafting stuff down here. I'm actually pretty much out of everything. Steel wire, bolts, pipes, rag, nails. Okay. Crafting materials were here since the crafting station is the only thing I can do down here anyways. Let me see if that's good enough. I don't think so. I need one more steel pipe. I'm short of pipe. All right, let's put all this away. That away. I've got a canteen and I got some food, my lock pick and an ax. So we're going to go out exploring again. So we're on the look on the look for driftwood. So I'm going to head just straight north here. We're going to go through the forest. I'm going to pick up a bunch of food along the way because I definitely uh, need some more of that. We're going to stop. Is this full? No, it's not even full because I, I made it. I never used it yet. We're going to stop at the river. We're going to fill up our hydration. Get a little button mushroom right here. I see you, cutie. Mwah. Delicious. Grab that. That's just a stick glowing. All right. Yeah. Keep looking around for food, golden mushrooms. That'll all come in very handy once we have our cooking station, I bet. And I could have... Oh, I should have brought my fishing rod with me. We'll save fishing for another day. This is an adventure for driftwood, not for fish. Okay, and then this refill. Beautiful stuff. Ooh, is that a burdock root? Thank you. That'll be some good food later, I'm sure. Uh, is there stump moss in that? No. If there was, I would have brought that with us. I feel like it's going to be useful in a bit. Haven't needed it yet, but... All right. So yeah, I'm just going to continue on up here, gathering everything I can. And hopefully we find out something new that brings us to where Driftwood is. I'm assuming by going all the way north, I'm going to find like a beach. Find I'm stuck on an island or something, and then there'll be wood washed across the shore. I don't know. 
making things up as I go and hopefully and hoping it's working. Oh, I found some thistle root out here. Let's see what this is all about. Grab all this goodies. What's that? Nothing. Decoration. The thistle root. Stack limit of 10. Climate sharp. Can be used as a brewing ingredient. So that might be good to have. I'll hold on to those. I'll keep that stack readily available. I don't care about the dotty mushrooms. Those can poison me if I eat them at like a 25% chance if I recall. But the only food I want to have on me right now is stuff I can eat raw. Pickling and berries and mushrooms and all those good things. Where are we? So we're over here still. A valley down there. Not looking for a valley. I'm looking for an ocean. You do need to eat a little bit of food. So let me eat um, burdock root. And I'll eat a, a lingonberry because it'll get me some of my health back. Perfect. Get that topped off just in case I get like frozen to death out here again. I'll take a morel. Yeah, I haven't seen uh, the dangerous creatures in this game. I think it's a bear, but I haven't seen it yet. This is interesting. Must be like really far away or something. I don't know. I don't know. Ooh, that looks cool. But we're just going to keep on exploring, finding all sorts of goodies. And uh, hopefully I find some driftwood. That's the whole point of this expedition here is driftwood. Ooh, we got some sort of new structure out here in the distance. Checking for bears. I'm getting anxious that I'm going to find one soon. Looks like a crashed satellite or something crazy. Oh, fallen water tower. That makes a lot more sense than a crashed satellite. I'm just saying. A lot more sense. Grab that. What is this? A little bit of rope. My inventory is full. So I'm going to discard these. I'm going to eat that raspberry. Oh, wow. I've got so many golden chintellers that... Ooh, some thistle root. I can get... I can get... Uh, on top of those, I can get three more. Two more. See some stuff over there, but I want to kind of... Walk around counterclockwise here and see what else we got. Here's a glass that I can't pick up. Oh, the box. Maybe that's... Ooh, I see a lock box there, too. Do that. Get some rags. Um, it doesn't look like I have to equip that, so... That's nice. Uh, I'll eat the black currant. I'll eat the morel just to get out of the way. Okay, there's two free spots. I got a lingonberry I can hold on to. Search this. I will take the turnip seeds. Hopefully, I've got room for them. Steel wire. I know I need one more steel pipe. All right, use lockpick. Search it. Oh, yeah, it's just like a regular chat, like regular search thing. And I still have my lockpick. Okay, maybe it breaks after a certain amount of uses, which I would find acceptable. But it needs to be a good amount because that loot is very lackluster. It's just like breaking open a chest, honestly. Nothing special to it whatsoever. Unless there's secrets in them. More so than the chest. I mean, we found blueprints in chests, so like you can't really tell me that's a secret either. Okay. Outside's almost complete. That's a bird awkward. I want that. Eat that. Give me that. Search this, so give me the steel wires. I want those nails, so you know what? I might as well just get rid of the turnip seeds for now. I'm good on food as long as I keep moving around, so. Old, but I'm full. You know what? I'm gonna discard those, even though those seem pretty valuable. I need to make sure I um, put a bunch of those in my chest when I get home. Think if maybe that'll give me driftwood, but no dice, no dice. Steel pipe. That's one of the things I need. A lot of mushrooms, a lot of thistle, steel wire, burdock root. I would love to keep that, but just get rid of it. What's this? Oh, wormwood root. Hold on, give me a second. Um, you know what? This seems easy enough to find. We'll get rid of the thistle for now. Wormwood root. Can be used for a brewing ingredient. Okay. 
I wanted to see what it was at least. I'll probably get rid of it anyways, but good to know. Good to know things. Grab this steel wire. I'll come back with a chest in a second here. Oh, nope, that's nothing. All right, now we can go inside. Old rags. Lots of stuff in here. What do we got? Planks. I don't really care about the planks. And cut down trees for planks. Use a lock there. So steel wire and some rope. It's like it's like literally searching the scrap piles. It seems to be the exact same loot so far. Like watch. You ready? Search. Hey look, steel wire and nails. <laughs> I really hope those lock picks don't break, because those are very crappy rewards for having to make an item. Blueprint, though. What do you got? Tent. This item is now available for crafting. Ooh. So now I can probably uh, post up. Oh, yeah. Look at me. I'm exhausted. Oh, and I'm cold. Oh, bother. I didn't realize it was nighttime already. I need to go home. All right. Long trudge home now. Let's see if I can uh, make it there safely. I've got golden mushrooms, so... Uh, that brings up my body temperature, not my health, even though the tooltip says it increases your health. It's actually your body temperature. So I'll be eating those along the way. And uh, hopefully I get home safely. If not, I'm going to freeze to death. And it's been a while since I saved. Found a bunch of these dog bane stems here over by um, this little tree icon on the map. So I'm going to grab those because we needed those for the uh, sewing room. Right, I'm freezing, so that means I'm going to take damage. So I'm going to eat one of these. Good stuff. Sir, give me these dog bane stems. My inventory is full, so seven to stack on me. Didn't I need eight of them? Ooh, bother. Um, you know, okay, I'll get rid of a bolt. And I'll take, I'll get another stack of these things. If it's true that I need eight, that means it need, I need slightly more than a stack. So, and I'd rather get everything and just have them and be ready. So I don't actually remember what else I needed for that. I didn't note it down, but let's eat another one of these real quick. But yeah, we'll see. All right, we gotta we gotta brave the weathers of the cold night tonight. So uh, let's hurry home quickly and maybe look into building a tent. So I don't know if I'm gonna make it. I don't know what happens if I get too sleepy. Look at that, uh, look at it. It's like bright red right now, and I've still got, I've got a little bit of a ways to go. I don't know if I'm going to make it there. And I don't know what the downside is to, uh, falling asleep out in the world like this. More to come. Oh, the mad dash. Look at this. Look how close the house is, and look how much sleep I have. I can barely even see the red. Get in here. Get in here. Sleep right now. Oh, my word. I need that tent if I'm going to do big explorations like I did today. Day five, though. Made it to day five. We are cruising. All right, with that, I'm going to hit this save button right here. Let's see what we need to craft this tent, though. Temporary shelter, but it will help you sleep outside comfortably. So sticks and some jute rope. That's nice and easy. Let's grab all the stuff. I want to make an axe. Heck, axe, really. I'm over here. Pickaxe. I don't have any space. I hate that. I'll put um the rope away real quick. I don't think I needed rope for this. Craft it. Alright, we got that. Water can. I don't need that just yet. And okay, that's good enough for now. Let's dump everything in here except for that. Um, and I'm going to take my fishing pole with me today. I need glue. So I only need six stems, 28 planks, and I need some glue. Let's see how I get glue here. 
So I need lime mineral, which is, I would need that pickaxe for. So we need to go to those lime caves. I need larch resin, which means I need to go to those larch trees that we found on the map. I also need yellow ash leaves. So that's not bad. And I figured out how to get driftwood. So how many planks do I need? I'm going to need some planks too. So I'm actually going to put the that away. I'm going to put the pick away. And I'm going to put a couple of those away like that. And also put a couple of those away. I'm going to eat two of these. Perfect. Now we're going to head out. I'm going to go. I'm going to go here. So as I was running for my life, past the river, I found driftwood at the river. So I just never noticed it before. It just looks like a stick on the on the side. But can I jump over this? Can I be crafty? Thank you. Don't get stuck over here and get soft locked. Thank you very much. Jumping takes a lot of energy. All right, I'll grab some of these ash leaves and then we're looking for driftwood and then we're going to cut trees. All right, what do we got here? What do we got? Some of the driftwood. I only need three pieces, so I'm just going to grab three pieces and when we're going home. Another ash leaf there though too. All right, so just rocks, rocks. I'm not crazy, I swear. I swear that it. it was here. Is it like in the water sometimes? Maybe not. Ah, see right here. Driftwood. Gotcha. Might as well drink the water while I'm here too. I'm just going to come over here. Do a circle. You'd think there'd be like a pile of driftwood just out here for the taking. Now it should be. Driftwood piece. Number two right here. What was that? No. These things are hard to see. Like I'm looking across the way and hoping... Oh, there's one. Yep. See, I did miss one. I say, hoping I don't miss any, but yeah, here it is. Gotcha. All right. Beautiful. I am going to start chopping some trees down. And we're going to go home with some fur planks. And we're going to build the, the chef room today. So I decided to kind of do two birds with one stone here. Uh, I'm heading over for these uh, larch trees that we have marked on the map. I don't know what kind of wood they give us, but we need the larch resin anyway. So I figured if I'm going to cut trees, I might as well come over here and just see what happens. And I can at least get some of the stuff to make the glue while I'm in this area. And then all I have to do is make a trip out to the limestone caves and get those. Look at these trees, they're beautiful though. They're really nice. Alright, yeah, so we still get sticks and regular planks. Some of the planks I've noticed have been falling through the world too. Like I missed a plank there. I didn't get any larch resin though. It could be because it fell through the world, honestly. Game is, in my opinion, not in a finished state. Lots of bugs. That's okay. Ready, and you see that fell through. So I got this large resin though. The plank that was up here fell through as well. I don't know if you caught that or not. I don't care about the sticks. I've got a lot of sticks at the house. I don't. Ooh, what's this? Hello, what are you? Campfire and campfire cooking kit. Ooh, baby. That'll come in handy. Anything hidden around the backside? Okay, large tree. We'll make a day out of this. We'll cut some of these down. We'll get some larch resin while I'm here. Hopefully that'll keep me stocked up for a while. Hopefully not everything keeps glitching through the ground. Give me that. Yeah. And then what I'll do is we'll head home. Post up for the day. And then we'll go to the... the we'll make the kitchen. See what the recipes look like. And then we'll head out to the salt... Or the limestone mines. And then we can maybe build the sewing room. But I don't know if we'll finish that all in one day. But, you know, we'll, we'll see what happens here. We'll see how kind of quickly I move. Yeah, guys, if you do love Among Trees, make sure you hit that like button down below. Like I always say, it tells me so much about what you guys like, what you're liking and what you're watching. And if you're new here, do hit subscribe as well so I can make sure to see those lovely faces again. But all right, I'm going to... I'm just going to boringly cut trees for a little while because I need the planks. And I want to bring a bunch of this larch resin back. So maybe I don't have to come here again. 
All right, so we've got everything we need to build our cooking room, otherwise known as a kitchen. All right, so new extensions, a greenhouse and a brewing room. Okay, so we can mix ingredients and prepare meals for the road. Cool, so I can get two new expansions, a greenhouse, glue, metal plates, and fur planks, and that's all things I can pretty much do. I know how to get glue. I just got to get that whole process. And a brewing room. Ooh. 12 dog bane stems, hoof fungus, and a bunch more fur planks. Okay. Let's see what I can do for food. Oh, just... Oh, like, I just mix things together, like... Like something like that? Hook? Oh. Uh, sticks. Sticks. I got sticks upstairs. I wish each crafting room had like a little chest in it, just so I, like I could store the room stuff in there. All right, sticks don't last long, but you know that's fine. So let me go look at glue. So I need, so I've got enough of the ash leaves. Obviously, I've got plenty of resin. I need to go get some lime mineral. So why don't I take that with me? What else is in here? All that's fine. I'm gonna need this. And I'm gonna put all of this resin in this one as well as that. I'll take that as well because that's an insulator. Put that all in here. And I'll keep the sticks on me. I'll just dump them down here if I need to. Dude, what do we make? Cooked food. I got a cooked food. All right. So that gives me like max hunger, max health, and max temperature. That's pretty cool. I really like that system, honestly. That's pretty nice. Um, What about honey? Can I do... Can I put... Uh, no, you can't use honey in there. It doesn't. It's not a cookable item, which is silly. I mean, I feel like I'd like some honey on some things. I don't know about my mushrooms, but... A fungus, right? Uh, cooked. Okay. So I can cook this stuff. I need it for the brewing room, but I'm going to make one more cooked food here. Let me turn that. Well, something like that even. Cook that up. Okay. And I got one more stick. We'll burn that in there too. I'm just going to put that in here. Um, I don't need that with me. Oops, I'll keep that with me just because I'm going to do that. Take this cooked food. Awesome. Now we got two cooked foods. That'll be good for the road. Um, I really should make that tent just in case, right? Well, I don't need it for this trip at least. Let's go to bed. Oh, I'm too hungry to sleep. Um, well, okay. Let's uh, eat that. I'll make another one though. One. Oopsies. Give me one of these too. Okay. Do that. I'm going to put one of you in and two of you. Cook that up. We'll let that go. I'm going to need another stick. I wonder if I could just use a plank. Nope. Must use sticks. Okay, so I do need to get... Bring the sticks with me or make a effort to acquire more. I'm going to need those to cook with. I'm assuming I'm going to need them to brew with as well. I don't know why I can't use planks. I feel like it'd be a better resource, but, you know, whatever. All right, cool. Cooked food. Take a nap, Ole. Little nappy poo. Day six, everybody. Day six. Gonna wake up. We're gonna hit that save button here. Boom, just in case something happens. And we're gonna head northwest. <laughs> Actually, is this one closer? No, northwest. We're going to go northwest past the river. We'll drink from there, and we'll go get some limestone. Can't wait. We're going to have to grab some more of the uh, un the cooked food so we can make some cooked food to bring with us on these trips. So I've been walking around here for a good while now. Um, you know, it says this is supposed to be lime mineral, and I just haven't found it yet. I've been circling around this whole thing here. 
Unless it's up there, like up on those rocks, which it could be. But if it is, I don't have any means to get up there. It didn't look like there was any secret passages. What's this? Oh, just a rock. So I'm still, yeah, I'm still trying to figure out where it is. I kind of, ooh, ooh, it's got to be in here. I thought it was going to be like where that symbol was, because that's kind of where it was with the trees. But maybe that's just a absolute center marking. It's got to be in this cave here. I didn't even know. I didn't even see this for a while. I was just hanging around by that river. Blue Pearl Cave. Okay. Drink the water while I'm here. Why not? Oh, there's lime. I saw a little bit of white. Oh, I'm starving. Eat a little bit of that. Get that delicious cooked food. Oh, yeah. Look at it all. Look at it all, baby. Bam. Give me that lime. How many of these stack? Ten? Perfect. We'll go back with like two or three stacks. We'll take every... Oops. We'll take everything that we can from here. Give me that. Don't lose these in the walls. Come on. Got it. Damn, give me these lime. I don't remember how many. I think it was like two lime, four ash, and one resin. So with this, I will make at least one glue. And then I'll just need to get some more ash leaves. Okay, I got, I found one more on the adventure in here. Up here, can I? What the? Uh oh, did I just soft lock myself? Please tell me I didn't soft lock. Sure did. What is, this is what I mean by like when I say the game is entirely incomplete. Like, look how easy that was to get in here. Didn't even have to try. That wasn't even like, I'm like trying to sneak around. It was just, gonna get in here. Come on. Yeah. Come on, white boy. Jump. All right. I'm stuck. Oop. Hello. So don't go that way. This looks suspicious. It looks very suspicious to me. You too. All right. All right. It looks like that's all that's in this cave. So maybe like every day or so that'll respawn. We also got the other cave that's near the house down that direction. So it's not too bad. So yeah, what I'll do is we'll head back. We'll get this all crafted up. Maybe I'll do a little bit of a uh, gathering along the way just to see what else is here. Maybe try and find three more ash leaves so then we can build two things of glue so I can make the sewing room and either the greenhouse or the brewing room. I kind of forget which one needed the glue. Yeah, I think it was the greenhouse that needed the glue. But all right, guys, yeah, we'll wrap up Among Trees here. Like I always say, if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button as well so you get back to that sweet, shabby content. And if you're loving Among Trees, make sure you hit that like button as well. It lets me know what you're thinking and make sure to leave a comment as well. But all right, guys, as usual, this has been Shabby Do, and hope the rest of your day is not too shabby.